Hello there, welcome to Basivan. In this video, I'm going to review session. So this is one alternative of Google Meet, Zoom, and Microsoft Teams. That means it's a software for video conferencing or video meeting. And it's a great remote collaboration tool. As you can see, they have put in 15 reviews on AppSumos and almost all the reviews are five stars. So I think the software is really good, guys. They're saying that sessions uh, is a meeting platform that lets you create and host immersive customer experience via webinar, workshop, and product demos. They're running the lifetime deal on AppSumo. The license share one pricing is only 49 USD here. You can have 15 team members, 45 participants per session, three hours per session, 90 days memory standard analytics. And if you get license tier 2, then you will get AI copilot. That means um, you will get here uh, AI uh, feature by which you can create um, poll, you can create question answer, etc. etc. Also, if you get more uh, upgraded tier, that means license tier 5, you will get here HubSpot and JPI integration. So these are the things, and you can change here um, the branding. You can have custom branding on all the tier. You can add your custom domain here with all this tier actually. Hope you get idea now without further doing let's go to the dashboard of session and let's explore how things works here and how it can be helpful for us so guys this is a dashboard and the dashboard is very minimal to start the meeting what you have to do just click here on this start a session and then here you have to enable the video and then you have to enable your microphone from here let me turn off this video from here and then now maybe i can enable my video so guys now the video has been enabled similarly you can uh, enable the microphone from here and then they have sitting that have audio sitting you can change your microphone you can change your speaker from here you can change your uh, video input device also from here hope you get idea and then they have background you can change the background let's say i will uh, convert it to a strong blur and if i just uh, use a strong blur see guys here uh, it's uh, a strong blur but also they have the option to upload your custom image for background you can upload here your custom image and then they have some um, some image that they have uploaded here you can use this image let's say i will use this one and then the background has been changed you can see here the background has been changed and here, this is my hand but it's not working very nicely i think so i think the blur option is um, looks good so i will use here light blur let's say see now it's light blur hope you get idea and here your post name will be inserted you can change the name and then just click on this join now so the session will be started here see the session has been started now what you have to do you have to just uh, copy this link and then you have to share this link to your um, team members or users who need to join here so let's say i will share this url uh, on my mobile and then i will join on this meeting by using my mobile phone so i'm joining just for some time i'm giving here on the button join now and then i think i will uh, join here see guys um, here yes here this is my mobile view the uh, in the right hand side you are seeing in my mobile and in the left hand side you are seeing me on my desktop actually hope you get idea guys and from here you can be muted you can mute others also and see the options that are available here. in the participant section you can see all your participants and in the chat, chat section you can chat with people let's say i'll chat here hi and here see this is the message people can reply here you can also send file here actually and then they have the poll and here i will explore what is ai copilot just click here on this ai copilot and then here enter your prompt actually let's say i want to create a poll where i can uh, test the uh, knowledge about uh, search engine optimization of the participants participants let's say and then if i just click here on this generate then the uh, poll will be generated see guys here this is the poll so in this way you can generate poll you do not have to write by yourself just you have to insert the idea and then this session will provide you the poll so see on what they have written how well do you know about search engine optimization not at all a little bit quite uh, well expert level let's say i want to use this poll just click here on this use use poll and then the poll will be added here hope you get idea if you want you can uh, add new response also just by clicking here add response you can select single choice option multiple choice and free text option and then just click here on this start poll and then this type of interface will um, be appeared in front of every team member or every participant and then 
people can vote here just by selecting one option people can vote see guys from my mobile phone i have voted and from my desktop if i just vote here then here see this is the vote so in this way the vote will be counted you can show the poll as you can see here this is the poll hope you get idea and now if you want you can end the poll just click here in the poll and then yeah, this is the poll uh, details or this is the poll result you can start new poll also from here just click here new poll you can write your question and response from here also hope you get idea after that they have question answer you can ask any question anonymously also available but let's say i will not ask anonymously so i'll and deselect it and then let's say fire from you and then if i just enter it then this question will be added and then if i want to answer here let's say let's say i will answer from my mobile phone let me here click on my mobile phone how can i answer here actually the thing is people can react on your question but people cannot uh, answer on the question directly actually see here you can see the uh, reacts only so these are the things about this question and answer option after that they have note let's say you want to add some note here you can add note here let's say this is my note and then they have the takeaway now in the takeaway section also you can add note but what are the difference between takeaways and note the difference is the takeaways will be visible only between the host and the notes will be visible to everyone that means your participant and your host everyone can see the notes but only host can see the takeaways hope you get idea guys and see on the notes section you can um, connect your evernote account also your notion account if you want just click here sync account and then you have to authorize your account and then they will be connected and the last option is transcript just click here on this start transcription and then your transcription will be started if you just click here on this option as you can see here they have one button and from here if you select your language there have a lots of language as you can see a lots of lots of languages that are available i am selecting here english you can select any language on, on which you are talking actually and i am talking in english right and it will transcript but it will take some time it's capturing your word and after some time you will get your transcription hope you get idea and it's not the end guys they have more option see they have the option and you can hide the cell view as you can see and here the cell view is hidden and then they have the background effect you can change your background effects from here that i have explored previously and then they have video setting you can change your uh, camera you can change audio setting your audio device you can change everything you can change actually from here hope you get idea you can mute yourself you can change your audio setting you can disable noise reduction also you can enable noise reduction also from here and you can share any file any tab if you want from here just click here you can embed a tool you can open a link you can share a file you can add an agenda here so these are the things you can raise your hand you can have different um, types of reaction here so these are the things actually hope you get idea and you can start recording of this um, meeting also from here just click here and then your recording will be started hope you get idea and from here in the share section you can share anything that you want you can share a file you can share a link you can share a uh, tool uh, to your participant actually from here i'm not sharing but you can share hope you get idea these are the things that are available here and they have gallery view they have a speaker view also here see only speaker view and they have another option which is enforce post view that means the participant will be enforced to uh, see only the post actually here if you enable this option hope you get idea i am enabling the uh, gallery option here so these are the things and um, then they have sitting and they have video sitting audio sitting background effect sitting that we have explored previously hope you get idea now let's say you want to in the session, uh, session you want to leave the session just click here and then the session will be uh, end and you can have here um, provide one uh, feedback also you can go to your home and here you can start your new session you can schedule a session or actually from here and you can create uh, one event also from here and if you go to the memory section here you will see all your previously done meetings and in the meetings you will be able to see all your previously happened memories so let's say i will um, open this one and here you can see the uh, session details you can see the analytics of this session you can download the participant list you can see all your previously happened chat polls question answer notes takeaways and transcript transcript things here actually hope you get idea about this memory section after that they have calendar if you have any scheduled session 
then you will see all your scheduled session here as you can see i have two scheduled session and um, you can see the bird eye view of your calendar you can see the monthly view weekly view daily view from here hope you get idea guys about this memory calendar and home section after that they have book me option in the book me option you can create your booking page which will work as an alternative of calendly also i think just click here on this new booking page and then the name of the booking page let's say booking page 2 uh, 2 and then here you can insert the description of your booking page you can select the session duration let's say 30 minutes you can have the custom also let's say you want to have the session duration maybe 50 minutes so just select it custom and then here insert your session duration but let's say i'll select here 30 minutes and email reminder let's say you want to send the email reminder one hour ago or one minute or one day or one week ago or let's say you want to uh, send another session reminder maybe one two days ago so you can select as many as reminder you want to uh, add and then just click here on this create booking and then your booking page will be created you can copy this booking page link from here and then if i open this booking page link in another window then let's see how it will look like so guys here this is the booking page and um, here people can select their expected date and time and then they can confirm they can insert their uh, details full name email and additional information and then they can book meeting for you actually so it will work as an alternative of calendly also i think after that they have event you can create new event here just click here new event and then here insert the event name let's say event uh, 2 and here insert the date of the event and in date of the event and time you can invite event collaborators here i'm not inviting and then just click here on this create event your event will be created you can copy this url and if you open this event in another window then uh, let's see how it will look like see guys here this is the event uh, people can uh, log in here people can register for this event here and they will be registered for this event actually they have a lot of other feature actually guys you can invite your speakers here you can add your agenda here you can have some advanced sitting here you can see um, all your registered um, members details here actually you can see the landing page here you can change the banner image you can change the logo image you can change the colors you can uh, insert your social media links here hope you get idea guys they have a lot of feature after that they have room if i just go to this room section if i create one new room just uh, let me click here on this new room and then here the room name will be let's say uh, room one and here this is the url of the room uh, you can log the room and that means only approved member can join on this room and in room details let's say this is the room details that i have written you can write anything that you want and then just click here on this create room and then your room will be created so guys the room has been created if i enter to this room then let's see what happened here so guys here it will be shown like that now if i join uh, on this room then actually it's like one meeting people can join on the um, room let me uh, let me join on this room from another window and let me show you how it will look like actually people will see like that uh, here also they have to just insert their name and then they can join on this room so the room is actually almost similar to the meeting hope you get idea guys i'm ending this room from here or i'm leaving this session so these are the things after that they have agendas and in the agenda section you can create your agenda just click here new agenda and then you can write your agenda here and you can use this agendas whenever you need on your session in the file section you can keep uploading your files you can upload here your documents image keynotes number pdf page presentation spreadsheet and videos and then you can share these things later when you are doing your session and in the tool section they have a lot of things see they have whiteboard if i enter to any whiteboard that i'm um, here see guys this is one whiteboard here you can insert any type of shape and you can have here the pen tool as you can see you can write here you can write here anything let's say i write uh, subscribe and these are the things actually you can upload here your image you can erase anything that you want so these are the things here you will get your whiteboard similarly here you will get youtube option by which you can uh, share any youtube video they have form you can create form and you can get response from your attendees here you can connect it with google docs with google form with google sheet google slide pitch vimeo also there have twitch uh, integration slide integration then airtable integration canva figma adobe xt integration is available 
hope you get idea guys about this session but it's not the end i have more feature if i go to the account setting section see they have integration and they have google integration office 365 integration icloud evernote and notion integration they have custom branding here you can enable custom branding and you can upload your own logo and your know, own session oil paper then it will be completely white level right but no, no it will not be completely white level yet because you have to change your domain right just click here on this custom domain and then from here also you can add your custom domain see that i have the step by step instruction how you can change your domain and insert your domain here then it will be completely white level you do not have to use zoom.com or google meet.com anything like that you can use mm, here your own domain hope you get idea guys about this seating option so these are the things that are available inside this session if you think as you need this type of software uh, for your business or for your personal growth then you can get this session lifetime deal from AppSumo. i'll give the url of this session lifetime deal in the description of this video just go to the description of this video and get the 10 percent discount on this session lifetime deal it's an affiliate link as if you use this link to purchase this amazing deal i'll get a small commission without costing you any additional money so if you think guys this video is helpful for you then please consider using this link to purchase this amazing deal and the last thing is visit our website www.pc1.com to get more tips and tips about growing online business also join our vip lifetime deal discussion group to the description of this video and if you haven't subscribed to this youtube channel yet guys then please consider subscribing this channel thanks again for watching this video